There you are. Hi, Heather. Hi, you guys. Uh, you knew something was not right. What was happening to you um, that caused you to maybe uh, say, I need to go to the doctor? Oh, I was a competitive recreational runner, a long distance runner. And uh, I started having problems uh, tripping and falling during the races, almost every race. And, and in fact, uh, one of the marathons I ran was in Washington, D.C. I actually still won my age group and already fallen down five times. I was about 20 minutes slower than I thought I could run it, but I, I was still won my age group, which was over 60 years old. So I went to uh, orthopedic, did some examinations, and I had, uh, I had some... Uh, Spinal injections, physical therapy. I wasn't getting any better. And this went on for about two years. Yeah. Finally, I went back to him and I said, hey, doc, I'm not getting any better. What's the deal? So I went to uh, a renowned neurologist from Johns Hopkins. So anyway, he put me up on his, on his table and he poked around at me a little bit. And he had different instruments like a feather and a, and a hammer. And he... Uh, said, okay, let's go sit outside in this office. And I think what you have is, is you don't have a physical problem, you have a neurological problem. And uh, I think that you might have ALS. And uh, all of a sudden I couldn't really hear what he was saying because it was just an initial shock. Right. And, uh, and he had me- How old were you? I was um, 62, oh, 12 years ago, I was 65, 65 okay. at the time, yeah. But since then, that's where the journey started with, with ALS. And, and from that, being at Johns Hopkins, he's had the opportunity to be in three clinical trials, 